Hey, it's Drew Bennett from BenSpark.com, and I just got back from California where I was out uh, uh, at DreamWorks Animation and uh, taking a look at some shows that are upcoming. Anyway, can't say much more about that for another month. But when I got home, uh, there was a couple boxes waiting for me, and uh, one, one thing, uh, way back when I did a, a video about some of the things that were coming out for... Captain America Civil War. Well, one of them was from Kellogg's, and it's this 3D viewer. So it's a VR viewer. And you put your cell phone in there, sort of like Google car Google Cardboard. It would have been awesome if it was Google Cardboard. They probably would have been a, nice, a much nicer uh, one, but you kind of have to put this thing together. It's yeah, fairly, fairly cheap. Um, I haven't actually put a phone in there yet. Um, but I do have, there's there's an app um, for Civil War, Civil War VR. And, um, see, Kellogg Civil War VR. It's going to be blown out here. So it's loading. And uh, I can just pop it into this. And then, you know, view it through there. Probably once I get it started. But I'll need like a... Um, a rubber band or something uh, so that uh, you know that I can see it so this is what the Captain America one looks like and it's all right um, you know I mean the other one's cardboard too this one's uh, Google cardboard is actually much nicer um, but you know it looks like Captain America it's got the big A there and I should be getting also uh, it's got like the wings um, an Iron Man one and a Black Panther one so, I got that in the mail. Other things that I got in the mail was a whole big box of books from uh, Disney Publishing, Disney Press. And uh, I'm excited about those. We got these beautiful hardcover books for Alice in Wonderland and then Alice Through the Looking Glass. So, these are the books based on the movies um, and, uh, you know, give these to Eva so that she can read them and we'll do a little review on those. Uh, in addition to those Alice books, there was this one, and this is all right now kind of, um, it's not all in plastic, but it's Alice Through the Looking Glass, a uh, matter of time, and it says, an impossible adventure with over 25 endings. So what I'm thinking, this is probably kind of like a, uh, you choose which way you're going. Um, there used to be books like that, they used to be called Choose Your Own Adventure, um, so... I'm thinking that it says that, you know, you may have to uh, flip the book around. You can choose who you are, either Alice the Mad Hatter, the Red Queen, or the White Queen. And um, so that might be that might be interesting. I think I think she'll get a kick out of that. It's funny, I got home and, and Eva had had um, book fair today. And she was so excited with all the books that she got. So I love that she loves to read. And she's my, she's my little reader. Now... It might be a little too old for this, but it is so beautiful. This Alice in Wonderland book. You know, just these, these beautiful uh, children's book here with the beautiful art. So, um, I don't know if we'll hang on to this or maybe, uh, you know, we'll go through and I'll do a uh, do a book review of it, and uh, after that, um, maybe to my niece, uh, or maybe, uh, maybe even want to keep it um, for later. So, another thing uh, that came in the mail was this thing, Treasures Adventure. It's a storybook, collectible toy, and puzzle. So it puts all those things together. It's um, you know for children, I think probably three and up. It says. Small parts, not for children under three years old. So I'm thinking it's three and up. Um, and it's just the, with the, these Disney palace pets. So uh, this little palace pet. And it looks like, it looks like there's the inside you have a punch out boat to set sail for adventure. Because treasure is the cat for, um, of Ariel's. So, so that. And... I got more of like a young adult book uh, called Once Upon a Dream, A Twisted Tale. 
and it was what if Sleeping Beauty never woke up so that's an interesting one and then this one is an advanced proof copy of um, uh, Tales from the Haunted Mansion so that the, the cover will probably not be the, the cover it'll end up with but uh, I think this one's coming out oh let's see July so uh, I'm gonna have, have to do a little uh, review on that do some reading um, this one's out on on sale it started on sale on April 5th so um, you know yeah that, that one's there and I think the other all the other ones are out uh, so you could you could pick them up if you were interested um, so it's kind of late. I spent a lot of time on the plane uh, watching shows and stuff like that. So uh, I watched the Agents of Shield, and uh, you know I really enjoyed that. And the Flash. Um, so tonight when I got home, we watched uh, Arrow. So we always try to keep up on Flash and Arrow. And uh, once those are over, it's like three more episodes of each, or three or four. Uh, once those are over, and also. Um, uh, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. So once those are all over, then we can kind of get to some of the other things in the DVR. The neat thing about our DVR is we got the Xfinity X1, and with that, you can actually have an app and download what's on your DVR to your phone, or to, like, I d downloaded some stuff to the iPad and some stuff to the phone. Uh, whenever I could get some Wi-Fi, I would download some of those things and then watch them. And that way, Allison could watch them at different times than me. And once we both watched them when I was away, uh, we just get them off, get them off the DVR. Um, one of them didn't work so well, but for the most part, uh, I had no problems and, uh, they were pretty good. I got to watch a, a lot of stuff that I wanted to watch. Um, and then, you know, not keeping, we're not backing up a whole bunch of stuff on, or, or piling up a whole bunch of stuff in the DVR. Um, I love TV shows. So, <laughs> um, anyway, this is Drew Bennett from BenSpark.com. Uh, it is May the 4th. May the 4th be with you. I was going to do some 4th Funko stuff, but didn't get a chance to do that. Um, tomorrow, <clears throat> actually going to go see Captain America Civil War. So, we got to get to some more of those pops and a whole bunch of other things that I got going on tomorrow. It's a busy day tomorrow. And, uh, yeah, so that's it. Uh, you can find me on Instagram at SpenSpark, on Twitter at SpenSpark, at Facebook.com slash I'm not a famous blogger. And also, you can subscribe because I'm doing videos every day for 2016. Thanks for watching.